Every community has a place where people come in to celebrate. And in Maysfield, for more than 50 years, that spot has been the Maysville Roller Rink. It burned down in a fire last night, leaving people to wonder where they will go now. LEX 18's Ricky Sayer was in Maysville at what's left of that rink earlier today. More than 12 hours after it began and firefighters are continuing to try to put out some hot spots. They know that this rink meant so much to the community. Where charred metals now sit was once a very special place. I learned how to skate there. I met majority of my friends there. Losing the Maysville roller rink in a fire last night has been hard on Aiden Lee. My heart just dropped. It was very heartbreaking. Heartbreak? doesn't come regularly. It wouldn't come if this was just a roller rink. This is going to be a total loss for the community because kids had nothing else to do besides come to the Maysville roller rink. Yes, everyone in this town seems to have been to a birthday party here. From the firefighters who tried to put out this fire to the state representative who stopped by. Being here as a young boy, coming and skating, and this was this was the place to come and hang out to meet with your friends. And friends formed lifelong bonds here. They met the people they'd marry here. Everybody was family here. There was no arguing, there was no commotion. It was just, you came to skate, listen to music, and have a good time. For more than a half century, the rink that once stood here represented the best of what a community gathering place can be. Now, I'd love to see him rebuild. This was always a popular place. Uh, the rink's owner says he's hoping they can do just that. In Maysville, Ricky Sayer, Evening Edition. Well, that cause of the fire remains under investigation. The Maysville fire chief telling us it's possible the wind last night did play a factor.